as you can see, we're not on the Suron today. So I had to take this little guy out. A little beast. 4,000 watt, 50 mile an hour bike. Doing some uh, test runs and just I'm gonna go take some pictures too. See how it does. Test out this new uh, mic that I really hope is working too. Ooh. No problem catching up. Nah, I'll go uphill. He's definitely gonna go too slow. I don't know if you can see, but this is going uphill too. We're 30 miles an hour uphill. Not bad. Let's uh, make sure this is working properly. Sweet. So the mic's working properly. First time I've had a working mic on one of my builds. I'm pulling this thing off. Get it on. Let's see what we can hit on this little squirt right here. Forty-five, not bad. All uphill from here. See, this is pretty steep. Hill. Let's see what we can do going uphill. Thirty-nine, thirty-one, thirty-four, thirty-five. This is pretty steep. Thirty-five going uphill. That's not bad. This is like up a very steep hill. So. Consistent, nice, smooth, 30. Yeah. You guys want, man? I can build you these bikes all day. My oh, shit, did I go the wrong way? I had to go the wrong way. Yeah, I might as well make a U-turn. Follow this Tesla. Obviously, it could go over forty-five downhill. I'm not gonna, not even gonna try and test that out. Go. Make it a little easier to see. Look at that. Here's the hill we just came down. Nice steep hill. Uh, how do I get to Ingalls Park? I think this is it. Nope, that's not it. Nice and windy. Hopefully, the audio comes out good. First time using a mic. Ooh, hard tails. Here we are. Marco. Gotta love it. Hills, trails for days. I probably should have stayed on on the street, but oh well. Let's 
see how fast we can do a lap. And, and no, we're definitely going faster than 13. Yeah, 30, so feels more like it. A good little bike. It's not a lot of sun here. Maybe take a couple pictures here and move. Alrighty, took some pictures back on the bike. So, I want to make one thing clear. You guys seen me. Hitting, uh, what is that, 45 max an ounce. This bike can do more than 45, and I've done more than 45. I've done 55 on a bike using this exact same setup. So, the bike can do 50, but right now I have it tuned to like 4,000 watts, 8,000 peak. But yeah, that's like not even one third of what this controller can do. If I turn it up, this bike will do over 50 easily. But just do a, for safety mostly, I have it turned down. Yeah, that's definitely a 50 mile an hour beast. Turned down to 45 right now, <laughs> but it's all good, 45 is still. <laughs> like really fast for this bike. Okay, right here is pretty good. Got the mountains in the background. I'm not bothering anyone. <laughs> Let's take some more pictures. Trying to sell this bike. Alrighty, let's dip out of here. Let's see, top speed 45. And I'm gonna try and do some speed runs on my way out. But uh, probably not going to go much faster since my battery is kind of low and I'm not turning up the power. But, yeah, if I were to turn up the power, definitely be able to hit 50. But we'll save that for another day. Or whoever buys the bike, they can do it. Okay. A lot of traffic today. House is right around the corner, but we're going to take the long run, get some speed in. I think he's as fast as me. No, where did he found? <laughs> you thought he could go as fast as me. Oh, shit. 
<laughs> the GPS is a little slow because it feels like I'm getting up to speed faster than my GPS is, is calling it. Yeah, this definitely feels like over 40. <laughs> I'm going. And yeah, this controller still has a lot more power it can push. Same with the battery. Still under the rated capacity for the battery. So. Pushes it no problem though. And we're back. Motor is even warm. Yeah, everything's good. 